Hey, what's up, man? I'm making you this video because it's a little more sincere. And I know somebody can just type something out and you could be like, eh, go ahead, you apologize, cool. But it's vaporous. It takes a little more effort to actually say something, to be upfront like this and uh, put the time in. You know what I mean? So I think I owe you that much, which is why I'm doing it in this fashion. I'm sorry for having upset you. I'm sorry for the things that I said. I appreciate the way you came to me as a gentleman and you said what you had to say, called me a shithead. You're right. I was shitty what I did. I was a shithead. But other than telling me that, what needed to be said, the remainder was gentlemen. That shows a lot of character and I admire that. So I would like to display the same character and return the gesture to you. I apologize for having offended you and for having offended your girl, who I believe is your girl, unlike the others who all just said that. When I was scrolling through my page, you know, that was the picture I saw. And if it was another model, you know, I would have made the same criticism. So it wasn't about her personally. It was, let me rephrase, it wasn't about her individually, because I know it was personal. But it was about the subject, not the individual. And that's no justification. I'd just like to clarify or at least help you understand the mindset that I was in. Because I don't want you to think that I'm a terrible person, that I'm a hateful person. I'm just a guy who's, I'm just a guy who's opinionated, you know, and I say shit that can piss people off because sometimes I'm unfiltered and I just speak my mind, especially on the internet, because in the internet, you know, you have a little more freedom to do that, a little more liberty, you know, it's kind of like road rage. Again, no justification. I'm just making a comparison. It's kind of like road rage, you know, you fucking asshole. But you wouldn't walk up to somebody personally like this and talk to them that way. You know what I mean? They're kind of not real till they're real. And this time it was real as a consequence. So even though I was talking on the internet and just expressing some opinion, which may have been an asshole one, it actually reached the person and hurt them as a consequence. So I have to take care of that. I have to fix that. You know, I have to own up to that and correct it. It's about integrity for me. And you being a man of character, clearly, I'd like to return that to you and have some integrity and own it and apologize for it. And to your girl is who I should be apologizing to the most. Ma'am, I'm so sorry for the things that I said about you. It wasn't right, and if it hurt you, I'm, I, I just, it hurts me. I don't know what I could do to make you whole, but I offer you my sincerest apologies for my comments and for my attitude. And I can see how that sort of thing affects other people as well. So I hurt more than just you, you know? I'm sure a lot of people's feelings were hurt. Speaking on the internet is not as vaporous as I may think sometimes. You guys seem like wonderful people, judging by your character, you know, and I would like for at least for you to believe that I too am or can, am capable of being a wonderful person, although at times like these I'm not. But I owe you my sincerest apology and I offer you that. Thank you for your time. And I like your pictures. I'm a car guy too. I go to car shows all the time. What you guys are doing, what you guys are doing is pretty cool. It's admirable, it's awesome, and I wish you guys the best of luck. Hopefully one day at a car show, maybe I can meet you guys and shake your hand. Buy you a drink. Something. But for now, this is the best I can do, and I hope you accept my apology. Ma'am, sir, thank you for your time.